Hello, hello, thanks for tuning in. Today we're gonna to take a look at the Pittsburgh Spill Free Radiator Funnel Kit from Harbor Freight. It's item number 58423. It says it easily and safely regulates the amount of coolant entering the system. Includes five adapters and caps to fit most cars, pickups, trucks, and farm tractors. Got the funnel, funnel lid, five adapters, five caps, two 45 degree elbows, a straight extension, and a stopper. And that's everything included. Let's get it open and see what it's about. Okay, there it is laid out. As you can see, it's got three different radiator cap adapters to fit most cars, and a whole bunch of other pieces and plastic parts. And it looks like they're labeled. This is Volkswagen and Audi. Uh, this looks like a Ford adapter, maybe. But the one we're concerned with is a Honda adapter. This is the earliest Honda model car that we've been restoring. If you haven't seen the videos, click the link above. So what you want to do is kind of find what fits your radiator cap and radiator opening. This one looks the closest, and we're just going to lay it there. And it fits perfectly. So we're gonna set that one aside, take this radiator cap off, put it aside. And then we wanna find which one of these fittings here fits in there nice and snug and properly. So that one moves around, it's not gonna be that one. This one's too big. Okay, that one fits perfect. So you want it to get in there and fit nice and perfect. And it's got a little rubber gasket there, so you're going to put it on. Put the radiator cap over it, the adapter cap. Put it on just like you would a normal radiator cap, and it's on there now. And we're going to take the bucket, put the bucket right in there, and there you go. It's on there. It's good to go. This is a stopper, so you can pull the coolant in and out. And we're going to get some coolant and fill it up and see how it works. All right, we got some coolant in there. As you can see, the stopper's holding it. And we're just going to pull the stopper up and see what happens. And it's going down and filling up. And they got that lid so it doesn't splash. You can put it on there. No leaks or anything. All right, and it all went down. We're gonna fill the rest of the system up. Then we're gonna start the engine with it on and let it burp itself and see how it works. Okay, it's done filling. You don't wanna leave just a little bit in there so when the system burps, it can suck it down. These older Hondas have a bleed screw here. We're gonna break that bleed screw open and let some of this coolant come down and flow out of here. That's gonna let all the air out of the system. Okay, we've let the coolant out of the little bleeder there. We still left some in there. We're gonna go ahead and start the vehicle and let it burp itself. All right, the vehicle is running and you see it burp down. So we're gonna pour some more in there real quick and make sure it continues to burp. Alright, about level. 
out of the system. No leaks or anything, so it's working good. much in there but you don't want to have any a whole bunch left over just enough to let it fill back up and you want to run it until the fans turn on twice and that'll assure that all the air is out of the system All right, once the cooling fans have cycled a couple times, you're gonna be left with some coolant inside the funnel. The cover here, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and just put it back on. You don't have to snap it on, just cover it so no debris gets in there and let the engine cool down. As it cools down, it should suck the rest of what little bit of coolant is left in there down and it'll be all done. All right, the engine has cooled down and as you can see, the coolant drew down inside of there simply going to just pull off the funnel and if you look down inside there it's filled right to the top <clears throat> so i think this is a great little coolant funnel kit for the money again this is the pittsburgh spill spill free radiator funnel kit item number five eight four two three definitely think it's worth a buy hope this helps thanks for watching please subscribe